morning, and thank you all for coming. And allow me to be the first to welcome you to the 25th anniversary of the North American International Auto Show. To me, the stories you've just heard from our customers illustrate why Ford is so special and much more than just another car company. They show that people are passionate about the Blue Oval everywhere around the world. Our Ford and Lincoln brands are a large part of millions of lives and we continue to grow. Last year, customers purchased more than 6 million new Ford and Lincoln vehicles. And that's more than 10% growth compared with the prior year and substantially more than the global industry's 3 to 4% growth rate. I love seeing new people from all around the world coming to Ford. Some are coming because we're now, are now offering great products that meet their needs better than ever before. Some because we're entering their markets for the first time as we continue to expand and take advantage of growth opportunities around the world. And others because growing economic prosperity is opening the door to vehicle ownership. Now we could just view this growth as a great business accomplishment, but to me, growth is an opportunity to contribute to a better world for more people. Through great products, good jobs, stronger communities, and the freedom of mobility. And the way we plan to do this is by our blueprint for mobility, which seeks to redefine the freedom of mobility that we've enjoyed for more than 100 years. Soon, we will launch a number of experiments in major cities, working with local partners, organizations, and other stakeholders to help define potential mobility solutions and opportunities. Ford is committed to being the leader in automotive mobility solutions. And as we do, we'll go further by remaining a leader in sustainable business practices and by introducing technology that will enhance our customers' lives. And nowhere is this more evident than in one product we'll introduce today. It underscores that fuel efficiency is now a reason to buy a foreign product. As part of our sustainability strategy, it uses industry-leading, high-strength, lightweight materials and technologies that make this iconic vehicle both tough and smart. And as we introduce such game-changing new products today, we're also focused on the future. For example, our automated fusion hybrid research vehicle is now on the road, helping us explore the opportunities of automated technologies and bring them to the market faster. Also, the CMAX solar energy concept we introduced last week at the Consumer Electronics Show channels electricity from solar panels on its roof as a possible next step in electrified vehicles. And they are all part of our vision to create great products, build a strong business, and contribute to a better world. In doing so, Ford will continue to represent something very special to millions of customers and preserve the world we live in for generations to come. Now, guiding us every step on our way is our one Ford plan, which has transformed this company. And here to tell you more is the man who led its development our president and CEO, Alan Mulally. Thank you, Bill. Four, one team, one plan, one goal. This compelling strategy continues to inspire all of us at Ford. During the past seven years, we have relentlessly implemented our One Ford plan, delivering the profitable growth and success that Bill just described. We are laser focused on making progress on our Ford and our Lincoln brands, delivering 17 straight quarters of profitability. Yet, even more exciting is the fact that we have only just begun to see the full potential of our One Ford plan. One Ford is focused on serving customers around the world with a full family of vehicles, small, medium, and large, cars, utilities, and trucks, each delivering the very best quality, fuel efficiency, safety, smart design, and value. 
Bill talked about more than 10% global sales growth we achieved in the past year alone. What lies ahead is even more impressive. We expect to serve even more customers and achieve global sales growth of another 25% in the years ahead. As we do, we will continue to become even more efficient, leveraging our global scale to deliver profitable growth. Our portfolio is more balanced than ever before. In fact, we expect small vehicles to represent more than half of our total global sales by the end of this decade, with nearly one-third of all of our sales coming from Asia Pacific. To meet this growth, we have increased our investment in new products and new technology. Increasingly, Ford is recognized as a technology leader and an automotive leader. With Ford Sync and EcoBoost as just two examples of us bringing leading edge technology to millions of people. Last year, we marked 10 million vehicles with Ford Sync globally in the six years since we introduced it and more than two million vehicles with our fuel-saving EcoBoost engines in four years since it was launched. This year is supposed to be even bigger and is the next major step in our one Ford plan. We are introducing the most vehicles in a single year in our history and investing heavily across the business for growth in the years ahead. Consider this, Ford and Lincoln will launch 23 new vehicles this year for customers around the world. 16 will be right here in North America, triple the number of new products from last year. <laughs> Supporting the new products is Ford's most ambitious manufacturing expansion in over 50 years, with two new plants in China, one new plant in Brazil, as well as increasing capacity and adding production in Russia, Turkey, and six of our U.S. assembly plants. This will mean the creation of 11,000 new jobs globally this year alone, and more than we have created in any year in more than a decade. Our one Ford plan is clearly delivering. We truly are serving more customers in more markets with a full family of best-in-class vehicles and delivering profitable growth for all. And we are just getting started. Of course, it all starts with great products. And here to tell you more is Ford's Chief Operating Officer, Mark Fields. Well, thank you and good morning, everybody. As Alan just mentioned, One Ford is about delivering profitable growth by serving customers with a full family of vehicles, cars, utilities, and trucks. A few years ago, particularly in this market, people knew Ford for our great trucks and Mustang, but not for smaller cars and more fuel-efficient cars. Well, times have really changed. Our greatest growth in the past seven years has been in our global car sales and utilities. In fact, based on Polk data, two of the top four Ford selling the best-selling name plates are Ford cars. Our global small car strategy began with the Ford Fiesta that we first introduced right here at this show in 2008. And since then, Fiesta's global sales have increased at more than triple the rate of the overall global sector, allowing Fiesta to become the world's number one best-selling subcompact. And Fiesta continues to showcase Ford's legendary driving quality with the multi-award winning Fiesta ST launched just last year. Next, Focus, which we introduced right here at this show in 2010. Now it's on pace to be the top selling nameplate in the world for the second year in a row. Our new Fusion, which made its debut in 2012, has just delivered a record sales year in the U.S. And we also expect sales to continue to grow with Mondeo's recent introduction in Asia, followed by Europe later this year. Fusion and Mondeo are also offered as hybrids, a part of the market where we've made substantial progress. Last year in the U.S., we doubled our electrified vehicle market share with our Fusion, our C-Max, and Focus, offering customers a choice between hybrids 
plug-in hybrids and all electric vehicles. In fact, last quarter, our plug-in vehicles, including the C-Max, the Fusion, and Focus, outsold both Toyota and Tesla's plug-ins. And of course, we've just introduced the new Mustang. It represents the heart and soul of the Ford brand and soon will be available to customers around the world. <laughs> now, let's turn our attention to the utility market. Globally, utility vehicles are growing faster than any other category. By 2018, utilities are expected to account for one out of every five vehicles sold globally. And last year was a record year for Ford's global utilities. With our sales growth, far outseeding that of the global utility segment. And we expect that growth to continue, with Ford challenging Toyota's utilities worldwide. And it starts with the Ford EcoSport, already the best-selling utility in South America and experiencing strong demand in India. We recently launched EcoSport in Europe, and ASEAN markets are soon to follow. Next is the Edge including the Edge concept we recently revealed. Now, Edge is a global success story, delivering record sales last year and soon to be introduced in Europe. Now next, Escape and Kuga, which have achieved a record year, crossing the half million global sales mark for the first time. And of course, our iconic Explorer, with global sales that have increased 163% in just five years, as we've introduced it to 116 markets around the world. Rounding out our utility lineup is the all-new five and seven passenger Transit Connect, which goes on sale in the U.S. this month. And it's aimed at an active customer who is looking for a different kind of people mover. Now let's turn to trucks and commercial vehicles. Globally, Ford is the largest manufacturer in the commercial vehicle segments in which we compete. And we are the first brand to win the International Band of the Year two years in a row. So let's start with the Transit Connect, our affordable small van that features industry-leading payload, cargo volume, power, and of course, fuel efficiency. Its sales have grown steadily in the past five years, and we expect that growth to continue. Next is our transit, which brings an unprecedented range of customer choices to meet customers' needs. Transit has been the symbol of work for customers around the world since it was introduced back in 1965. In fact, we've sold more than 7 million transits globally to customers in 111 markets. Transit has been the best-selling commercial vehicle in the UK for 48 years. And this summer, we'll begin building it in Kansas City for our U.S. customers. And Transit will eventually replace our E-Series van, which has led the segment for 35 years straight. Next is our global pickup, the Ford Ranger, also experiencing tremendous growth. Sales have increased 26% since 2010 when it was introduced. And last year, Ranger sold more than 160,000 vehicles across 167 markets. Sales of our heavy trucks are growing as well. The all-new Ford Cargo in South America is up 10%, and our Ford F650 and F750 here in North America finished 2013 up 21%. And this spring, we start the production of the 2015 F-Series Super Duty with its second generation Ford design and built 6.7 liter power stroke V8 diesel. It is our most capable, efficient, and powerful Super Duty yet. F-Series, it is one of the best selling vehicles in the world. It's been the best selling vehicle here in America for 32 years, and it's been the best selling truck in the US for 37 years. Well now, it's time to reveal the future of Tough and the next generation of a Ford Icon. And to do that, please welcome our President of the Americas, Joe Hendricks.
everyone. As Mark just made abundantly clear, F-Series has a storied history of truck leadership, building on decades of dominance. Why? Because we know our pickup truck customers. Confident, demanding, tech savvy, and above all, passionate. And the same can be said about the team behind the groundbreaking new F-150 you're about to see today. Now being a leader means you set the standards that all others follow, and then you exceed them. And that is exactly how we approached this opportunity. We live trucks at Ford, and doing so means we can anticipate the needs of customers better than any other truck brand. And beyond our undisputed sales leadership, the record of game-changing innovations that define the segment shows just how we know, how well we know our customers. We were the first to introduce a luxury truck with the King Ranch and the Platinum. And we challenged convention in the industry by putting an EcoBoost V6 in a pickup truck, giving customers capability and fuel efficiency. We have now sold more than 425,000 F-150 trucks equipped with EcoBoost engines. So as we saw customers increasingly using smart tools and techniques like real-time earth monitoring, wireless computing, and precision-guided equipment, we saw an opportunity to give them the same smart approach to technology in a truck. In short, customers inspired us to create a new 150 that is tough and smart. Tough, proven out by more than 10 million miles of built Ford tough torture testing that only the new 150 can survive. And smart, delivered in the form of advanced materials and new technologies never before used on a full-size pickup. Ladies and gentlemen, let's take a look at the all-new F-150. There you have it, a new era in built for time.